You know what this is? It's a spirit cloth. What does it do? Oh, it can contact the spirits. I'm going to try to do that. Spirit, 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 are you there? Seems so. Can you hear me? Ha! Huh. I have a problem. I've got an upset stomach. What can I do? What is that you say? What? Celery? Celery? What do I do with it? Juice it and drink it? It's going to restore the acid in my stomach? Ah, pretty interesting advice from a spirit. Well, there's others who get advice from spirits too. The medical medium. One of the most interesting characters I've ever run across. His book, New York Times bestseller list. Anthony William has no medical background, no scientific background, which he freely admits. But he doesn't need any because he's got a contact with a spirit. Only he can hear the spirit. And he says that he hears him loud and clear in fact, when he was a youngster, four years old, he even saw him as a gray-bearded man. And ever since then, this spirit has been offering him advice. William has a radio show. And on this radio show, he asks people their symptoms and gives them advice that comes from the spirit world. The advice almost always is to drink celery juice because he says it has curative properties, anti-inflammatory, uh, anti-cancer properties, all kinds of wonderful things. Well, like any vegetable, celery does have some interesting phytochemicals. And some of these in the laboratory, in animals or in cell cultures, have some interesting anti-inflammatory, anti-cancer effects. There's nothing unusual about that. There are dozens and dozens of vegetables out there that have the same effect if you isolate some of their components. It doesn't mean that any single vegetable is the miracle food. This is absolute nonsense. He tells us to drink 16 ounces of celery juice a day. First of all, that will put you in the poorhouse. Celery is very expensive. This stock costs four bucks uh, today, and you need a lot of celery to, uh, to juice. And also, if you do that 16 ounces, you'll be overloading on salt, very high naturally in salt, and also in nitrates. And there's a concern about nitrates because in the body they can form nitrosamines. You may notice these days that many hot dogs and ham say no added nitrate or nitrite. That's because instead they use celery juice and that will furnish the nitrates and, and the nitrites. So here we have a situation where a, a man who has no scientific background is giving advice to the public about serious diseases, including the treatment of cancer. And he claims to get messages from the spirits. And these spirits are all knowing. All right, well, let's encapsulate this. What do we have? We have three possibilities here. Either there is a spirit world out there, and there's a spirit who has chosen Anthony William from everyone in the world to communicate medical advice to, so he can then pass it on to the public. That's one possibility. The other is, that we're dealing with sort of a clever charlatan who has found a way to get money from people. And the third possibility is that uh, we're dealing with someone who needs a little bit of a psychiatric evaluation. Which is it? Your choice. And uh, I like my spirit here because he isn't bogus, right? I can call upon him whenever, but I will freely tell you that what you're seeing here is a magic trick. And I am not going to claim that I have any kind of psychic powers and be wary of anyone who claims to have a real contact with the spirit world.